Hello there. Um, so today I'm going to uh, do a quick uh, tutorial on how to remove a white background from a photo. So a lot of the time when you download uh, stock photos, for example, they have a solid white background and oftentimes you want to get rid of it. So uh, this is going to be super fast. It's already assuming that you have, you know, downloaded GIMP and probably used it a couple times at least. And uh, so uh, I'm using this uh, image as my example today. And you can use any um, sort of stock photo with a solid white background uh, to do this exercise if you want. So um, as you probably already know, uh, in order to open a photo in GIMP, all you have to do is drag the thumbnail click and drag over to the toolbox once GIMP is open. And uh, there we go. And I'm going to go to the view menu and do the zoom. I'm going to go to 100%. Okay, so once your photo is open in GIMP like this, then the first thing I'm going to do is go to the select menu. I'm going to go select all, and next I'm going to go to the image menu. I'm going to scroll all the way down to guides, and then I'm going to scroll down to new guides from selection. And you might notice that that just creates these lines around our photo. So that's all we are doing there. Uh, so if you don't already have this little box over here open by default, uh, the layers uh, menu, then you'll want to go to Windows, Dockable Dialogs, and right here to Layers, and that will open this if it's not already. So you should see your photo open as the only layer in this window. And so what we're just going to do, we're going to click on it once to select it, and we're going to right click, and we're going to scroll all the way down to Add Alpha Channel, and we're going to click on that. Okay, so all that does is, is adds a transparent background behind this layer. So now all we have to do is go on over to our toolbox over here on the left. Let's make this a little bigger. And uh, what we are looking for is this little icon here. It's called the Select by Color tool. So go ahead and click that. Okay. So now all we have to do is go over here to our photo and click in the white background portion of the photo. So just anywhere in the white and just click once. And you'll see that it creates all of these moving dotted lines around the girl. So uh, next, well, we are going to go back to our toolbox to the eraser tool this time right here. We're going to click that. And then uh, we're going to go over here, down here to the brush, click that once. And we're going to change this from the soft brush to the larger uh, solid circle. And then uh, beneath that in the size here, we're just going to click and drag this all the way up so that it's huge. You'll see it's very big. Okay, it's maybe a little too big. <laughs> okay, yeah, you can play around with that a little bit. There we go. So um, so now all I have to do is um, click once with my mouse and then drag the eraser around to start removing the white background. Look at that. Super easy, simple, and nifty. And as you can see, it only removes the white background, which is what we want. Um, so you see in her face right there, it, it took a little bit of the color out. So what you can do in that case is uh, in the select by color, there's a threshold bar. So we'll take this and we'll, we'll go all the way down that way. And then we'll click again. And it should have less of that this time. Or you just be a little careful around the face area, see? There we go. Perfect. 
So now we'll go select none. And we'll go file export as. <clears throat> We're going to change this extension from JPG to PNG. We'll save that on my desktop. Export, export, and and there she is with the transparent background now. And that's about as simple as it gets. Thanks for watching.